The federal government is tabling legislation to improve oil tanker safety in BC's coastal waters. It's a move designed to ease concerns over projects such as the Northern Gateway Pipeline. But environmentalists say the announcements today are plain insulting. CTV's Louise Hartland has that story. We need a world-class safety system for our waters. With an active shipping lane at his back, the Natural Resources Minister unveils new measures aimed at protecting Canada's coastal waters. We have an opportunity to ensure that our products, particularly oil and liquefied natural gas, reach world markets and command world prices. Oliver and the Federal Transport and Infrastructure Minister are in Vancouver touting the eight measures to strengthen tanker safety along Canada's coasts under the new Safeguarding Canada's Seas and Skies Act. They include increasing tanker inspections, including all foreign tankers, expanding air surveillance and ship monitoring programs, establishing a Coast Guard incident command system for faster response, conducting research to understand how products such as diluted bitumen affect the environment after a spill and modifying the Coast Guard's current navigation system to warn of obstructions and mark preferred shipping routes. We understand that here in British Columbia people love the beautiful environment in which they live and want it preserved. The Enbridge Northern Gateway Pipeline proposal has brought tanker safety on the B.C. coast to the forefront. The proposed line would run from the Alberta oil sands to a tanker terminal in Kitimat before it is shipped down the B.C. coastline. The province's environment critic says measures are no measures. The risks of shipping oil on our coast outweigh the benefit. British Columbians are worried about the costs of a catastrophic oil spill. Uh, that risk is posed by the Enbridge Northern Gateway project. We've got a $2 billion fishery, for example, on our coast. Uh, none of the First Nations of British Columbia support this project. It lacks a social license in BC. Environmentalists to say facts. today's I mean, announcement like is said, insulting. Oh, I don't see anything that was proposed today as absolving people's fears here. Yeah. So I think they've just come here with uh, uh, an effort to try and persuade us everything is fine and it's not. The government Concerns disagrees. What we're announcing today uh, is, a, is a result of our listening to British Columbians and responding to their concerns. Concerns that environmentalists say can't be washed away with a few new laws. Louise Hartland, CTV News, Victoria.